Is hydrogen power the future of motoring or just another case of overhype? On paper, hydrogen fuel cell vehicles known as FCEVs sound like a dream. They emit zero harmful emissions, just water vapor puffing out the back and lightning fast refueling times of three to four minutes when you compare to current day electric vehicles. So no more waiting around for hours at a charging station. Heavy hitters like Toyota and BMW are backing the tech with BMW allegedly gearing up for hydrogen technology by 2028. If anyone can make it work, you'd assume it's these companies, right? Well, not so fast. The reality check hits hard when hydrogen infrastructure is practically non-existent, especially in Australia, making refueling an absolute mission. Just look at the Toyota Mirai, which barely even scraped 2,000 sales globally last year. That's not exactly future of driving numbers, isn't it? The tech is promising, but if you can't refuel the car, what's the point? Still, the dream isn't dead yet. Toyota and BMW are throwing some serious cash at hydrogen development and industries that need long range and quick top ups like trucking might give it a fighting chance. So anything's possible. But let's be real. If a Chinese company suddenly drops a dirt cheap hydrogen vehicle overnight, we might just see this tech explode. Until then, it's looking more like a niche solution rather than an automotive revolution. But what do you think? Would you buy a hydrogen car now or is this just an expensive experiment and make sure you follow my channel so you can keep up to date with all my new videos thanks